What does it mean to find God? In this Torah portion, Parashat Vayetze, Yaakov is fleeing from his house, from his home, from his parents, from his security, from his safety, and he wrestles. He wrestles with himself, he wrestles with his environment, he wrestles with the unknown, he wrestles with the vulnerability of life. And all of a sudden he goes to sleep and he puts together those, according to the Midrash, 12 stones that become one when he wakes up. In that dream, he sees a ladder with angels that are going up and down. They are coming from Yaakov, from his needs, internal needs, to go up to God and coming down. He wakes up and he says, Achen yesh Adonai b'amakom hazeh, v'anochi lo yedativ manora amakom hazeh, en zeki im shar ashamayim. Indeed, there is God in this place, and I did not know that before. How awesome is this place? It's not just but the gate of heavens. Yaakov is recognizing that presence of God. Chaverim, we live in a time in which we feel that everything is very vulnerable, unpredictable. We live in a very chaotic world. We live in a time in which I feel that those malachim, those angels, are crying today as long as God is also crying today of all the victims of terror. All those who think that they are finding God in those words of Allah U Akbar are probably just playing with a different kind of values or maybe with no values at all. This is not what God brings to us. The way of finding God every single day is a challenge, but it's a challenge that we can conquer if we allow ourselves to do so. So may we encounter Malachim, those angels that allow us to find that presence of God, that awesomeness, as God today is crying with humanity, with God's own creation, crying with humanity for those victims of terror.